Hi, it's Kim from Affordably Crafty, and today I have new yarns at Joann's. Two new yarns, and I am going to be walking through and showing you all the yarny goodness. So this is the first time I've seen this in person. This is the new Lion Brand Skein Tones. Now, I have seen some influencers review it, but it's the first time I've had it in my hands. And let me just tell you, it's by Lion Brand. It's basic stitch anti-pilling. It's 185 yards or 170 meters, and it is a four weight, 100% acrylic, five millimeter needles and hook, and machine washable, tumble dry, gentle cycle. And this is the color honey. This is no dye lot, that's good. And boy, was this stuff ever soft. It was really nice, definitely a premium acrylic. I kind of wanted to get a bunch and make like a striped sweater. Maybe like, ooh, maybe like a chevron sweater since some of these are very 70s colors. Wouldn't that be cool? What do these yarns inspire you to make? Let's see, this is almond. And for those of you that don't know, this line was created to represent more of a broad range of skin tones. That's why the play on skin tones with skein tones, hazelnut. There was a broad range and they're very complimentary as you'll see in my yarn pyramid in a little bit. I do love making my yarn pyramids. This is, is it toffee? Nope, cedarwood, cedarwood. Very nice. This is actually a nice peach. Not that it's my favorite color on the block, but it was a nice, like, subtle peach. I think it's peachy. Yeah, peachy. Mm-hmm. Peachy. And then they had ivory. I believe this one's called ivory. How are you excited about the Skein Tones line? Which one is your favorite color? Um, truffle, that's nice. Now it looks like they only got maybe six of each skein in. Um, ooh, this color is really nice. This one's probably my favorite of the lot. This is, is this cinnamon? Uh, do do as a name. Oh, that's adobe. Okay, that's my favorite color. I just think it's such a warm toned brown. What does this inspire you guys to make? Let me know down below in the comments. Also, let me know if you've seen any other new yarns out and about that I have not um, shown on a walk with me or shop with me. Because I love to catch some new stuff. Mahogany. I did go down the aisles and check the clearance yarn here to see if any of the, whoa, that was my sneaker, discontinued styles had been backfilled yet, and they have not. So I will be sharing that with you guys as soon as it happens. Again, this is my good Joann's that I usually film in. They tend to get all of the new yarn and all of the yarn the fastest. Coco, cacao. Here is my beautiful skein tone pyramid. It is beautiful and I love yarn pyramids. Enjoy this yarn shelfie. <laughs> okay, then there was a super duper chunky stuff made for Lion Brain Yarn for Yarn Workshop with a chunky knit yarn, perfect for knitting blankets or pillows. I'm not familiar with this company. Um, 28 yards is a jumbo seven with the 25 millimeter hook and needles. So it's only 28 yards. It says it takes five of each of these to make knit. If it's knit. I don't, I don't know about you, but I really don't want a scarf out of this. Might be a little too choky, personally. Um, that was mustard. And this one is, va what is this, vapor gray or something, I think? Nope, sorry, that's linen. I don't know why I'm trying to guess at the names. 
Yay, purple. But yeah, so the scanner was down when I went to the store. So I will put the prices in the description box down below if you want to check those out. I will also put <clears throat> my walk with, no, I'm sorry, shop with me at Joann's where I did all the clearance run through recently. So you can see if you need to pick up any of those discontinued lines. And you'll see what I mean when I say that there are some large holes in the aisle right now that need to be backfilled with new yarn. And hey, if you're new here, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, follow me on Instagram and join my Facebook group where I post about all my steals, deals, and freebies I find in my travels in the crafting world. And hey, this Saturday, last Saturday in May, um, we on Affordably Geeky Live are having our first maker feature and that is with Pink Sheep Designs. We're super excited. Um, one of Evelyn's specialties is using yarn on the chunkier side. So I got to assume she'd be excited seeing this. And the fact that it actually uses a 25 millimeter hook, which I'm sure she owns several of. <laughs> Do you guys own a 25 millimeter hook? What's the biggest hook you own? Comment down below. I have a 35 millimeter hook and that's my biggest one. That's by the hook nook that I got at Joann's on clearance. Mm, love me the clearance. <laughs> they had like three different colors of blue, which I was surprised about because like they didn't have a huge color range for this yarn. Maybe these people, the knit workshop really love blue. I'm not sure. A yarn pyramid upcoming. And yes, please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can learn how to be affordably crafty too. Have a creative day, everyone. Make sure to catch Affordably Geeky Live Saturdays, 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on my channel, Affordably Crafty. Have a creative day. Bye-bye.